well done, Brad, this evening. Yeah. Rare, rare appearance in goal, must have enjoyed yeah. it, and getting yeah. a man of the match just rounds it off. Yeah, of course, yeah, that's no, brilliant. Uh, I love coming in to play when I can. Uh, I'm always ready to come and play. Um, you know, I'm here for the team. I'm a player that just loves to come and play for this club. The fans were brilliant again. Um, yeah, let's top it off. Clean sheet and another win, and see what happens in the in the group stages. And some smart saves in the, in the second half. Couple that you looked at you fairly quickly, sir. Mm. Yeah, I mean, just I, I mean, I'd expect myself to save them. To be honest, I'd, I'd, I'd back myself to save them. Um, just routine saves, uh, keep keep the boys focused, keep myself focused all the way through to the end, see it out, and yeah, got the three points and a clean sheet. So, players must be delighted to have gone through. Obviously, we need to wait and see what the, what the Chelsea yeah. result is. But against a, a decent Oxford side tonight, that was yeah. a really, really good the number of chances on our side as well. That was a really good result. Yeah, definitely. I think our group definitely was tougher than last season. I think uh, the Chelsea game again, another clean sheet. The Leighton Orient one was just unfortunate. I think we could have had it. Obviously, he's been getting sent off. It couldn't hold it. And then tonight, putting a, another home performance in like that and getting a clean sheet and a win. Uh, who knows what can happen again this season? We've got a great bunch in there. We, who knows if we can go all the way again? Like last season was unbelievable. Let's crack on now and do it again. On the pitch, what was the view of the first half? Because it's fairly, fairly even. They had a lot of the ball, but it didn't yeah. seem to do it. it didn't seem to, to hurt us too much. We got a couple, yeah. a couple of the post. Yeah, a couple of the post. I don't, I don't think we were troubled as much. Um, I think they had, they had a good few chances, but then so did we. You know, it's fairly even, like you said. Um, yeah, I don't think I was tested as much in the first half. It's pretty end-to-end -end sort of stuff. We sat in, defended well. Our shape was brilliant, I thought, and uh, they couldn't break us down. So I think all, all, in, all in all, it was a good performance yeah. from the boys. In the second half, important to get the early goal and pushed on, pushed on from there. Yeah, definitely. I think once once we got the goal in, we sat in, kept our shape well, and then um, they could, again they couldn't break us down. Uh, got the second goal, sat in again, and any any team to come here and beat us and put in a performance against us, fair play to them because we're a team that. We'll sit in, defend for our lives and get and grind up results. And we've got a great bunch in there, like I said, and we'll go all the way to the end. And you, as you said, you know, this is, we love this, we've done well in this competition, Todd, Todd loves this competition, yeah. and, and yeah. through, to the, through to the next round, must, exactly. be, uh, must be looking forward to it, just hoping maybe that we'll be finishing on top of the group and get home exactly. on time next round. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So we'll see what the other boys did in the, uh, in the um, late Northern Chelsea game. We topped it brilliant if we didn't, and we see what we get, and we go from there. But who just say we can't go to Wembley again? Yeah. From your, from your point of view, you've worked with, you've worked with Lewis and Jack. Is it a good, good, good combination yeah. of three? Yeah, three of we've got a... as well. Goalkeepers all seem to work very well together. Yeah, we do. We, we've got a good bunch. We get on well. We're, we're there for each other. If one needs to play, we'll, we'll back that person. If I need to play, they'll back me. And it's always it's a healthy competition. I always say it's, it's difficult being a keeper. You know, you only get one position. Only one person can play. And when it's your time, you've got to do well, you've got to shine. And if things don't go right, they'll be, they'll be there to support me and hold my head up right. So. But if, in that situation, you, you come into the side tonight, do you feel under a little bit more pressure? You know, goalkeeper is very much a, a sort of focal point position, isn't it? As well, it is. As defender or midfielder or striker, you sort of get a yeah. coming goal, you're in the spotlight. Do you feel under a bit of pressure in those situations? Um, yes and no. Uh, I feel like there's, um, there's a certain amount of pressure that you just have to take on board and you sort of just get on with it. I think going into every game you have to have the same mindset whether it's a game every week or a game every month or two months or who knows when you're going to play but I think the main thing is just training well train like you're going to play because you never know in football it's a weird old game and if you get your chance you take it and you keep the shirt you just keep doing well that's all you can ask for you've got to do that tonight well done Brad thank you very much cheers and yeah, brilliant thank you